the girl who used English to blackmail. Friday, 3:25 p.m. Candy is waiting for her friend Mandy, so they can go shopping together. But she is about to get a big surprise. You need to go shopping. I'm sorry, I can't. I have to go to the detention class. I didn't do my homework. Oh no! I have to go. I'm sorry. But we've been planning this for weeks. I'm really sorry. Can I call you? My phone is broken. Remember? Oh no! What should I do? I don't know. I have to go. But but. Meanwhile, on the other side of the playground, Ricky and Mickey are up to no good. Mandy is curious, so she goes to investigate. Let's find out what they are doing. Ask how much it costs. Ask how much it costs. We were just trying to find out our new computer games. We want to go buy a five phone call. We wouldn't want a pizza call to find out about this. Okay, Dad. You guys don't need to worry. Your secrets are safe with me. I like computer games too. I think you should go and buy it. There, just one little thing that I want you to do for me. I want you to deliver a message to Mandy Lam in the detention room. What? Are you crazy? We can't do that. I think you can. Or maybe I should talk to the principal about what to do. That's blackmail. Yo, Mickey, that's an ugly word. We are just doing each other thing. Now, here's a message that I want you to say. I want her to meet me at the front door at five o'clock. How are we supposed to get into the detention castle? If you're a clever boss, you can figure this out for yourself. Ricky and Mickey talked about it, and they decided that they had no choice. They would do what Candy had asked them to do. So they decide to put Ricky's plan into action. Candy was about to get her second surprise of the day. They were using their mobile phone on school property. He already knows that. The moral of the story. Blackmail is no way to solve problems, especially on school property. That's blackmail. 
blackmail why hit that's blackmail blackmail why hit